Ready, set, go. Suit on, helmet on, race on. Get into gear at Daytona Manchester for the ride of your life. Run out of gas? Well, on Wednesday nights, students get 10% off with a valid NUS card. Drive your way to victory in the UK's premier indoor racing venue, Daytona, Daytona Manchester. Manchester. Need a ride home? Need it to be cheap? Why not give us okay. a try? Call us on 0161 555 017. Nick's taxis are guaranteed to get you where you need to be. That number again is 0161 555 017. Yeah. Okay. yeah, that's great. Yeah. Cheers. Okay. All right, the ad breaks on the system in 10 minutes like normal. Uh, I'll just give you the, the cue now. Gascoigne Ale is the great taste of an ale pint without the alcohol. It can be found in all good supermarkets next week. 105.9. 105.9. Northern Soul FM. Good morning. And good evening, whichever way you want to look at it. <laughs> Welcome back to Live on the Mic with Mike on 105.9 Northern Soul FM. If you haven't already guessed, I am your host for this evening, Mike. Thanks to John for his call just before the advert break on the Conservatives' new regulations on fracking. If you have something you want to share on the air, then give us a call on 0161 222 or text in on 08 treble one. Later on in the show, we have a new radio play from the writer of Where's My Hyundai? <laughs> All that and more coming up later on in the show. So keep your calls coming in and let's have a chat, shall we? We are here with you till the breakfast show at 5.30 a.m. So we have plenty of time to talk about whatever it is you would like to talk about. I believe we have our first caller coming in uh, right now. And yes, hello, you are live on the air with Mike. Who have we got there? Hi, mate. I'm Stephen. Hello, Stephen. And what would you like to chat about? Well, I've um, just moved into a new house, actually. The uh, kids are starting school soon, you see, and it's great. It's really great. Four bedrooms, big back garden, the works. But um, the neighbours are less than ideal, you know what I mean? <laughs> yes, the old uh, nightmare neighbour next door type situation. Exactly, exactly. You know, they're so loud. I mean, they're playing music till the early hours of the morning. I mean... I'm not being racist, but these types of people are just absolutely disgraceful, you know. Uh, 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 <laughs> sorry, just to stop you there, um, Stephen, the problem you have with your neighbours is their race. No, th that's not what I'm saying at all. You're not listening. I said, I'm not racist. I'm just saying that I think if these people want to come to our country, they should abide by the same rules. Don't you go around branding me some fucking racist. You'll get used to it. Uh, sorry about that, ladies and gentlemen. We are having a little technical difficulty. We are trying our very best to get Stephen back on the phone. But until then, why don't we go to our next caller? Hello, you are live on the air with Mike. Who have we got there? We're your program. Shit! Ladies and gentlemen, Stephen Wanker. Hello, Stephen. Hello, Stephen. Hello, Stephen. Hello, you are live with Mike. Who have we got now? Hello, you are live with Mike. You are live on air. What would you like to chat about? I'm going to kill myself. Excuse me. I said I'm going to kill myself.
Hello. Hello, Mike. What's your name, sir? My name's Mike. Just like me. Just like you. What's your real name? It's, um... It is Mike. <sighs> yeah. What's your full name? I want to know who I'm speaking to. It's Michael Bolton. Michael Bolton? Really? Well, your parents must have been big fans. <laughs> so, um... Why do you want to take your own life, Mike? <laughs> That's not really important. Isn't it? I don't think so, no. Then why did you call into the show? I'm not quite sure. I've been listening to your show. You're a good listener. I thought, maybe you could listen to me. Where are you, Mike? Not too far away. Are you in your house? Yes. And where's that? Well, I'm, I'm not going to give that out on national radio. Are you alone, Mike? Because there's people out there, there's... There's organisations that can help you. Like the Samaritans, have you tried calling them? I'm not alone. My wife is asleep right next to me. Your wife? Well, then you need to think of her. Do, do you have children together? Two. One's 13, the other's 11. Well, then you need to think about them. And you need to think about her because you don't want to leave your wife to raise your kids on her own. Life hurts more than death, Mike. And as for it being selfish, I believe that's something only selfish people believe about suicide. This isn't about anyone else. I love my wife, and I love my children, but they're not me. When did you begin feeling like this? Just turned 15. Teenage angst. They said it was. It would pass. And as soon as you put on a Joy Division record, Everyone around you cements it in their mind. It's only a phase. And it's been like that. All leading up 
of this singular moment with you, Mr. Bolton. This is the culmination of my life's work. Look, Mike. Mike, what are you planning to do? Because I can't decide whether this is a, a cry for help or a publicity stunt. And I'm going to be honest with you, Mike. I don't believe we get the listening figures to make this a, a happening. What are you going to do to yourself, Mike? Did you ever see The Godfather, part two? No, I saw the... I saw number three. Right. Well... There's this scene... at the end of the film... with... Frankie Five Angels... in a bathtub. And... there's some razor blades. Okay. Well... I've just run myself a scorching hot bath. Okay, all right, okay, Mike. Mike, level with me here. You've decided to call in. Okay, and if you wanted to do something, you would have just, you would have just done it. I believe you called in because you wanted me to talk you out of it. And I'm trying. But you need to let me talk you out of it if that's what you want. I, I took the day off work, made a day of it, ran a bath. I spent the whole day gearing up for it. And then my wife came home with the kids. So I drained the bath, made us a chicken teriyaki for tea. I put everyone to bed. Ran another bath. And now I'm here. I think it was during the day that I decided I was going to phone you tonight. Have you ever thought of, um, of getting any help? It's not help that I need. You see, that's the problem with everyone these days. Every soul is salvageable, even the bad ones. Who says that I deserve help? I'm no angel. Who is Mike? That's an interesting question you pose, Mike. A conversation to have, perhaps, another time. Mike, listen to me. And believe me when I say the world is a more interesting place with you in it. I'm afraid that's just not the case, though, is it? Listen to me. There are two people in this recording studio. But there are a lot more people out there listening and no one... Nobody wants it to end like this. Well... That's just what you think I want to hear, isn't it? So to you, Michael. And everyone else out there listening. I think it's time to say goodbye. Wait, wait, wait. Mike. Please. Listen. I don't know you. And you don't know me. But this is all, this is all we got and... And I'm asking you. Human being to human being, don't do this. 
I can't speak on behalf of anyone else, but I've got to know you tonight. And I can visualize the man behind the phone. I can picture you and your wife and your kids. And it'll be such a waste for you to throw this away. Life goes on, Mike. People say life is short. It's, it's not, it's long. Which means you've got plenty of time to get better, Mike. And you have plenty of time to heal and I I hope you believe me, because... 105.9 105.9 Northern Soul Wait, no, no, I've got it, I've got it. Don't be under the illusion that the royal wait, family wait, wait. spend their days... Just calm down. There's no more back. One second, one second. Shh, calm down, shh, calm down, well down. wait. Please, 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 please. Okay, okay. start it, start it, here. I'm away from the phone, but I'll be back. But leave your number, and I promise I'll call you back. Or you can catch me, maybe, at the home number. Speak to you then. Cheers!